It's a process that usually takes years, but in the race to beat the Ebola epidemic, doctors and scientists are speeding up efforts to create a vaccine against the virus in a matter of months. World Health Organization officials say trials are now underway in the United Kingdom, United States and Mali. Phase one clinical trials of the two most advanced vaccines have started and that result from these trials will be available in December. Drug manufacturers are currently working on at least five other potential vaccines. WHO officials will determine which works best in trials and then hope to have hundreds of thousands of doses ready for use in West Africa by the middle of next year. Vaccine is not a magic bullet, but when ready, they may be a good part of the effort to turn the tide of this epidemic. First in line for experimental vaccine trials, healthcare workers on the front lines against Ebola, including Liberia, where the virus continues to spread. More than 400 new cases were reported there last week alone. Doctors at this hospital in Monrovia say they're still suffering from a shortage of beds and staff to treat the infected. Ebola has caused a serious stand still in our economy, our social life. It has changed our lifestyles, it has changed cultural and social relationships, and it has caused a lot of suffering. Germany is the latest country to send volunteers to West Africa on a humanitarian mission. Training started this week for soldiers in the German army and members of the Red Cross, with intensive drills on everything from donning protective gear to taking care of infected patients. Despite the risk, volunteers say they are ready to help. In regards to Ebola, we received excellent training here, so I feel that nothing can go wrong. More international help and hope for a vaccine. Both can't come soon enough in West Africa. Michael Holmes, CNN.